Hello, welcome to Coin Sutra, and today's video is for all the crypto users who are looking for the best Solana wallet, who wants to understand how to use the best Solana wallet. And the wallet that we are going to talk about is called Phantom Wallet. Now, Solana is a growing ecosystem just like Ethereum is. And in the last one year, the price of Solana moved from $1 to $260 at the highest. And right now it is sitting at $212. And Solana ecosystem is growing a lot of action is happening they have solana name service which uh and i'll be doing a video about this in the in the upcoming videos then they have nft marketplaces called digital eyes and solana art where you can buy nfts you can launch your own nfts but to do this to do all this you need a wallet you can't use metamask for solana um, so what you need is one of the solana wallet and if you see solana has a lot of popular wallet like phantom solid solfair slope math wallet but the best one and and hands down the best wallet is phantom wallet and in this video i'm going to show you nitty gritty of phantom wallet what are the things that you could use how to use the phantom wallet how to send receive funds and all the features of solana wa phantom wallet that you should know about. so very first thing depending on the browser you are using solana phantom wallet is available for firefox chrome brave so in this case, I'm using a Firefox browser. So this is the Phantom website, phantom.app. Make sure you use the official website. And once you are there, you can click on Add to Firefox. So yeah, this one is click on Add to Firefox. Uh, let's And Phantom Wallet is added. Now, if you're using Chrome browser, here you will see this option called Add to Chrome. And you just need to do the same thing. So now I have Phantom Wallet installed here. And you can see here, this is the Phantom Wallet icon. So very first thing is you can create a new wallet or if you already have a wallet like any of these other wallets, which I've just shared, Solate, Solfair, Math Wallet, Slope, you can recover it using your recovery phrase. So in this case, let's create a new wallet, okay? So this is the secret recovery phrase. So let me make a note of it, okay? And I saved it somewhere, now I need to create password so let's add a password and um, this password is unique password okay so let me walk you through this so this secret recovery phrase is your password for this wallet if tomorrow your system get hang or you lose access to your system this recovery phrase is what you need to restore your all the crypto coins, all the assets to a new device. So this recovery phrase is the most important thing. This is called seed word. You need to note it down on a piece of paper. Keep keep the piece of paper somewhere safe. There are seed phrases device that you can use to store this password. But for now, for the sake of this tutorial, I'm storing it online. I'll be deleting this wallet after this. But if you are using it for your main wallet, you know, make sure that you note it down on a piece of paper and keep it safe okay so let me and this password is what you would need once in a while whenever you are accessing phantom wallet so this is uh this password is important but even if you uh if you lose your device and you are restoring your uh phantom wallet on some other device all you need is the seed word okay so save this do you want to follow them on twitter you can and then click on finish okay so this is a wallet okay now here now let's understand this wallet let's understand what all are the features of this wallet so that you can start using it okay the very first thing you will click on deposit and you need to deposit solana so like in ethereum we have ethereum we need eth as to pay the gas fee in solana network we need sol to pay the gas fee you can buy solana on binance or even on ftx i'll leave the link of both the exchanges in the description so you can buy it from there and withdraw the Solana uh, token on Solana blockchain here. Okay, so that's for deposit. You click on deposit, you search for the token that you want to deposit from the Solana blockchain. So SOL is one. Then another project that I feel very good about is Ori. You can, you can, you can get Ori token and so on. Now that's about like receiving the token. Okay, so you click on that. You will get your wallet address just copy it and withdraw fund to your Sol Fan solana phantom wallet okay so let's go back now if you want to send fund to somebody you click on send you search for the fund that you want to send for example uh 
you paste the address here so let's just paste this address okay okay now okay so i don't have funds so i can't send any fund because otherwise like the idea is to click on the token name and then click on send so we can't do that now this second option is called collectibles and here is how it it's shown like you know let's see so this is send and receive this is how it she how you can see you click on collect nfts and when i click on nft this tab it would show me all my nfts and if you have nfts from the same collection it would group them all together so it does not look messy which is pretty good another very good feature of phantom wallet is swap tokens if you swap one token to another if you want to convert your soul to usdc or you know similar pattern you can go here you can enter the amount and then it would uh, in the decentralized manner it would use a dex to help you swap your token from one to another which is another great feature uh, activity would show you all your activities that you have done and now let's look at the solana phantom wallet setting so you go here uh, you can rename your wallet so let's name it uh, tutorial wallet okay you can you can change the language if you want you can, there are multiple languages uh, another very cool feature is address book so if you if there are a particular address in which you have to send your token once in a while you can add them in the address book you can label it and you can add the address that would make your life easier then trusted apps would show you the list of all the apps d apps that you have interacted using phantom wallet and you have given permission to access you can remove them from here all right you can change the password the lock screen password auto lock timer is self explanatory you can the wallet would be all auto automatically locked after a certain time so it's, let's set it to 10 minutes and if you are if you are a developer and you want to work with the testnet or you know devnet you can use that but by default you would be using mainnet dot you can always delete your remove your wallet if you want you can see the secret recovery phrase again that is the seed word that we have seen in the first phase so you can note it down at the later stage but that's not all the party has just started because you can create n number of wallet under phantom wallet so if you want to have 10 solana wallet you can just click on add connect wallet click on create a new wallet and and just create a new wallet right so this is wallet number two this is first wallet this is wallet number two now i don't see this option to add uh, add a hardware wallet and that option is available on your chrome browser so if you are using phantom wallet on chrome or brave browser you can actually add your hardware wallet to your phantom wallet and this is something i highly recommend if you are using any decentralized wallet like uh, metamask or phantom or even terra station you should be using a hardware wallet because it adds a level of security and this is something non-negotiable so if you have not ordered a ledger nano x go ahead order a ledger nano x today it cost you about 160 to 200 dollar it will take about one month to deliver but that is the best way to keep your crypto assets secure because what what happened just now is like when i click on create a new wallet right and and here's the thing so so this recovery phrase is shown on my device right and there are probability that our devices our computer our mobile are hacked and a hacker might be seeing whatever we are doing so now they already have our secret phrase now if you have a small amount they might not bother but if you have a big amount uh, or a considerable amount they would like simply sweep you know hack everything but when you have a hardware wallet like ledger nano x you would not reveal the secret phrase on the screen it would be revealed on the hardware device itself that makes it wallet security to the next level so that's about phantom wallet now this is how you would be start using phantom wallet uh, click on deposit deposit some soul like you know this is the wallet address deposit some soul and that's it start using it like you know if you're going to let's say bonfida here you will see this option called connect wallet connect with phantom wallet okay like this is how you connect with any services for example if you want to connect digitalized services select phantom uh, see what this app would like to do like your wallet balance and activity request approval for transaction which is very important and then click on connect so now it is connected to my phantom wallet now if i have balance i can simply go and buy any of these nfts uh, 
and that's how it works. So that's everything about Phantom Wallet. If you are interacting with Solana based ecosystem, which you should, and then you should be using Phantom Wallet. And let me know if you have any question about Phantom Wallet, using Phantom Wallet. Now, one very common question that I've been asked like, hey, Harsh, I've been using the normal Phantom Wallet without hardware wallet, but now I've got a hardware wallet. How can I move my existing wallet to a hardware wallet? And the short answer is you should not do that. What you should do is that you should add your hardware wallet, send all the uh, coins that you have on your normal wallet to your hardware wallet, and then start using a hardware wallet as the main wallet. That's the best way to keep your crypto secure. I'll leave the link of Legend NOX in the description so that you can order it from their official website, which is again, very, very important. With that guys, let me know if you have any question about Phantom Wallet. My entire team, CoinSutra team is there to help you level up your crypto knowledge. Do check out our earlier videos to understand a lot of nitty gritty of cryptocurrencies. And with that, I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye, this is Harsh.